All right, fitness fanatics, it's 2021, it's a new year, new you. So I've been doing all these exercise videos for everybody that are my clients, but how about for everybody else? So a lot of people that are not my clients have been asking me about stretch videos and um, or stretch exercises and what to do for different parts of their body. Um, one of them is the low back. So. For me, I've had a sore low back in December and it was just like not as much moving. And so um, I'd say everything's connected. Your your strongest chain is through your weakest link, right? So um, we have to work on our glutes, our hamstrings, our abs, our obliques, every part of our body to keep our body in the right function. So no muscle imbalances, right? So I'm gonna show you some exercises that we can do to help our low back today and to uh, just try to stay healthy and avoid back injuries, all right? All right, let's do this. All right, guys, so why was the chiropractor busy? Because he had back-to-back -back meetings. <laughs> all right, so that's our little joke for today, but we're gonna get into these exercises right here. Um, I already warmed up my back with a heated vest. You can find these heated vests on Amazon uh, as low as $39 all the way up to $129. Um, they have uh, shells that are $39 and then the, with the battery pack that sits inside the vest, it'll heat and cool off your back as well for $129. So $39 to $129 depending on what you want to get. And so... That's a good way to start with a warm up on your back. Onto the floor and I'm going to push my back, my low back into the mat and then just grab above my knees and try to keep my back pushed into the mat. So if you're feeling any back pain, if you have like major back pain and it pains you to do this, don't even do it then, stop. You know, you probably need to go see a doctor or something like that. But uh, this is a great way to avoid back injury. Just kind of morning stretch. Get in that morning stretch, just hold it. And then let it release. And then you're gonna come back up for about five of these. So at least five of these to start activating your back because then we're going to get into a little bit more back stretching and exercise. So you're going to release, come back up, pull. You should feel it in your glutes a little bit. And uh, we're activating different muscle parts here where we're trying to stretch out, roll out that back a little bit. Here we go. Down and up. Okay, and one more. Down and up. All right, I'm gonna turn to my side a little bit, side to side rolls. Just kind of lean and keep that knee tucked. Those knees tucked into your chest the best you can. Now at this point, if your head starts to get, your neck starts to get heavy, rest your head back, but continue your rock, okay? Side to side, rock. So just laying back, chilling, and then side to side, you're rocking, okay? All right, so that's a good way to start for a little warm up of your, your back stretches. Now I'm gonna do some crossovers. So I'm gonna come and cross my leg and then extend the leg and then just slowly let that back stretch and keep my shoulders down okay so you can use a band a lot of times i use a band to pull up my leg on this point you know a belt a towel or a band or a stretch band would work to start stretching out your hamstrings a little bit longer too and then we're going to come across and open up that hip so a band works good on this but I'm doing it today, just body weight work. All right, so now opening up my hips. Now I'm trying to push my back into the ground here. I'm trying to just like let my 
hips open up. So tight hips can put tension on your back as well. So if you have tight hips like most men do, then you wanna to try to do some of these morning routines, morning exercises. All right, good. I'm gonna come back to center and I'm gonna switch. So I'm gonna to go to my other side, slow, low back stretch. Try to touch my toe to the ground over there. Now the hardest part for me, I do have tight, a tight upper back as well. And I'm trying to get my shoulders to push against the mat while keeping my toes down. Notice I'm having a hard time getting my toe down without my shoulders coming up off the mat. So this is, this is the hard part right here for me, just trying to get my back to loosen up, especially in the mornings, it's pretty tight. And then I'm gonna come back across, I'm gonna open up my hip and try to get the other leg to go straight and that's where I'll feel it, either in my hip or my hamstring or in my low back. And for me, I just need to work on my hip activation as well, stretching out my hips a little bit, and trying to work on not having tight hamstrings. My hip is pretty tight on the left side there. All right, back to center. And then- Second part, I'm gonna do a pretzel and uh, I'll show you how that works. So I'm gonna lay on my side and I'm gonna have my bottom leg nice and straight, my top leg bent, try to get my drive my knee into my chest. I'm gonna grab with the opposite arm and grab underneath that leg and pull up, pull that leg up. Now that bottom leg, I'm gonna to try to grab with my ankle. This is always a tough one for me, just to get the starting point. Now that I got my ankle, I'm gonna pull that pretzel. So. Now, this is a great stretch for your hips. Your, I feel it a lot in the glute, in the low back, and even in the quad, that bottom leg quad. But this one, you're just holding about 10 to 15 seconds, trying to get a good stretch out of it. Feel it a lot here, and then release. Now, if you had really bad back, you wouldn't be able to do this at all. So this is to avoid the back injury, okay? So just help you to be a little looser and not so tight. Here we go, we're gonna come back up, 15 seconds. Just pull, pull hard, bring that knee into your chest, and release. Good, back again, pull. Oh, I just popped my back, it feels really good. Oh, that helped a lot. So again, pull. You're doing this for about 10 times to really get a release. If you have a tight back, it's popping again. Wow, so my morning back is just like so tight and it's just from sleeping. It's like sometimes not sleeping in the right form or whatever it is, I get tight. All right, I'm gonna pull again. It's starting to feel really good, feel a lot looser. This pretzel really helps a lot. Come back up and then release. All right, you would do that for about 10 times probably just to start getting a looser back. I'll show you one from the other side and then we're just gonna switch. So, bottom leg stay straight. Top leg, gonna grab with that opposite arm. All right, if you liked my stretch video, uh, DM me, message me or whatever, and uh, I can give you some more uh, private one-on-one -on -one stretch videos or exercise videos that I have. And um, yeah. Have a great Monday. It's Monday Bun Day, so I'm gonna work on my buns today with some squats, some deadlifts, and just range of motion exercise movements that I can do to help only strengthen my body a little bit more, my back, my legs, that foundation, and build my way up. All right, let's have a great day.